Namaste, Namaskar, Vanakam, Sastriya And welcome back to Grow with the Jan family. I'm Anjali. And I'm Jaden. And today we're going to be movie reviewing on the movie we just saw in the movie theater called... Yeah. Okay, I hope you guys didn't have your earplugs in for that one. Yeah. <laughs> Namasha ready! Right? Namasha ready! Whoa! All right. This movie was amazing. Yeah. Amazing, yeah. amazing, amazing. And I can't even say again, amazing. Um, loved it, right? Yeah. Yes. So we're going to talk a little bit about our favorite parts throughout the movie. And then uh, we'll do some other things. We'll talk about some more. So, yeah. Jaden, I'm going to have you start. What was one of your favorite parts at the beginning of the movie? Mm. When she tells the... Um, when she tells the story. When like, she's telling the story? Uh, yeah. yeah. So she's telling the warriors the story about Syrah? Mm hmm Right? Yeah. So what was your favorite part, Anjali? So my favorite part was when Amitra Bachchan was training him, and he was like, I don't care if I die, I will kill ten soldiers, was an Amitra already um, saying. And then Amitra Bachchan... Bachin said um, that it doesn't matter if you live or if you die. What matters is that you win. The fight, right? Yeah. yeah. So fighting the fight. I mean, this was such a historical movie. And, uh, you know, at the beginning, uh, my favorite part is probably when um, Lakshmi meets him. Oh, well, yeah. finds oh, yeah. him. So she comes into the town for the festival. And the festival, oh my God. This is like what I believe India looks like every day. <laughs> every day, yeah. Oh, I'm so pretty. I mean, the shots were amazing. And the temples and the colors and um, just beautiful. But when she comes into the town, because she's going to dance, um, and she goes to the water to kind of have her prayer. Like, I don't know if she was taking a bath or doing like a prayer um, in the holy water. And that's when she sees Jan and Jeevy. Mm -hmm. That was probably one of my favorite parts of the beginning um, to start off yes. the love story a little bit. So before the struggle really started, before the fights really started, there were a few key parts I feel like in the movie that were significant. So yeah. what was your favorite part, Angie? My favorite part was when the British soldier asked the man to run. And he said, if you could beat the horse by even just one step, then the whole land that you stepped on is yours. But if the horse beats you by even one step, then the horse, you Then know, it goes to the British. It goes to right? the British. And the man, even though he knew he wouldn't win and he knew that, you know, it wouldn't be his, but he still ran. He tried. He really tried. Hard. And even when he fell down, he got back up and tried to run again. Mm -hmm. And then that's when Sharon G became from the horse. Yeah, that was amazing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And scooped him up and, um, and there was some fighting too. That was awesome. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, I liked the, the when, so I think it's the same older man. I think uh, Subaya is his name. Yeah. So Cherenjivi goes to the other council, like, not council, I think it's like They're, his brother um, and chiefs. the chiefs from all the other towns, yeah. uh, villages, and he wants to get them to be on his side and, and join with the struggle and help fight. And, and they kind of laugh at him. like They also say, like, they were going to go apologize. And then he yeah, was like, they were like, no, we will get you off. We'll get the British to, to take your, their bounty off on you and we'll give them whatever taxes they want. We want you to just apologize. And so this will just end. And he's like, I am not, I'm not apologizing, apologizing to those. I mean, the British in this and, and we know the British were not nice at all. But this really depicts them yeah. as um probably how it really was like just using people as a step stool and calling them a uh, horrible things and just treating them like crap and uh, yeah that was bad yeah um yeah. but you know just that yeah and so all these kings are like you know they're they want him to apologize they want to just you know give the taxes in and, and not really join in the fight and he's Pretty much like, I'm going to fight, and I'm going to go. And when he walks out the door, 
there's some, you know, Suvaya and a few of these other local farmers that are out there, you know, and they're like, Suvaya's like, I will fight. I have been, you know, working out basically is kind of yeah. what you said. Um, and I can, I will kill 10 people before I die, but I want to be part of the fight. Yeah. You know, and for the freedom and, and for the struggle and just, you know, it, it touches your heart. You know, he's like this older man and, you know, and he's like, I will give it my all. And, and then a bunch of other people. And then I feel like that's when the, the other kings or rulers were kind of like, oh, now they kind of seemed like, mm, maybe that is a good idea. Mm -hmm. You know, if they all joined together, there was a lot of them. And all the people in their towns, you know, granted the British had cannons and um, guns and horses and stuff, but, you know, there was a lot of stuff, I feel like, a lot of people working together. And he kind of started it, like, you know, it took a little while for people, I think, to kind of get on board with this, with his fight and, um, and get behind him. But yeah. I feel like once they did, they, they gave it their all in this movie. It was just amazing. Right. Mm -hmm. So what was your favorite part, Jane? My favorite part is when, like, he, like, in the water, he get the, um, king, the, um. British soldier. Yeah. He, like. Popped his hair <laughs> in the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before that, there was the fight, though, right? Yeah, where he comes through the bushes, like you see in the trailer, and and he fights these guys. And I mean, I loved the action part of that, yeah. where he goes to do like hit them, and and he kind of jumps and swings and misses their sword, and then gets them, you know, yeah. and and then fighting inside some of the buildings. And we saw how they remade that and they did yeah. it. That was really cool that it was like really boxes yeah. and stuff. But in the movie, even though I knew that in my head, it was like, it was awesome it, how yeah. it came out. Like I would never have put those two things together, like seeing a little bit of how they made the movie and then watching it. You know, I knew it was coming. And yet in my head, I couldn't see like how they made that happen yeah. without you seeing that it was different. I don't know. It was really cool. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, there was that big struggle and, and that British captain was mean. And, mm -hmm. um, so Chiranjeevi definitely uh, gave him what's for. Yeah. In the water. Right. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That was a uh, pretty cool fight scene. I don't know how that was going to end, but what about the ending? So, there was a lot. So this was like the first big fight yeah. where he won against the, the British shoulders. And then I feel like the struggle, really, the war and the struggle really started. Yeah. You know, and um, when they're fighting the British and the war is on, like big time war yeah. is on. What is your favorite part? So one of my favorite parts is when the Tamilian warriors come in and they're trying to pay this man like pay him to show him where Chir Chiranjeevi is or Syra is mm -hmm. and what I thought at first was like they're actually like bounty hunter like they're trying to get him right but then they like they like stab the man that asked for the money mm -hmm. to find him and they're like that's his price and then they bow down to Chiranjeevi and then it's like we came from Tamil Right. And we're here to fight with you, to help you with the war. And he's like, how did you know about the mm -hmm. war? And it's like, we hear all these songs about um, you and Syra. And he then knows that right away that it's luxury. Right. Yeah, because he sent her to spread her, her beautiful dancing yeah. around, you know, and she chose to spread the word of Chiranjeevi Osiris. And encourage people yeah. to help him. Well, I don't even think, I think she was mainly telling the story. Yeah. And that kind of stirred up enough people and people came from all over to join his fight. Yeah. Um, his freedom struggle fight and with the British and that was just amazing, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what was your favorite part, Jaden? My favorite part is like when he whipped the people out of the horses mm -hmm. mm. in the battlefield right oh, yeah mm -hmm. there's a lot of battlefield scenes yeah and 
you know, he comes with two swords, but he fights awesome, mm -hmm. right? There was a lot of um, uh, kind of martial artsy, but slow motion. That was yeah. the other thing I noticed. Some of the things he did were like slow, slow motion, motion, like cutting um, someone. Were really cool, right? Yeah. Fight scenes, yeah. Okay. Awesome, awesome. Um, I liked uh, towards the end when um, they capture Lakshmi oh. and uh, bring him, bring her to the British, and yeah. they're like, she's the one that's been spreading these stories and getting people to help the fight and. Um, they try to make her dance for them, you know, and they think they're yeah. being all, I don't know, like they've got her and. Um, but she's got them. Yeah, mm -hmm. she definitely uh, tricks them just as much. So that I'm not going to give that away because that yeah. was probably one of my favorite scenes in the entire movie. Yes. I mean, I love this movie, all of it, but this scene and I'm not giving it away. So I'll no, try not to. Not. We try, we've given a few spoilers away. I don't, don't want, want you to give all too spoilers. So you don't like you guys watch have this to go and see then it. watch, I mean, watch the yes. movie. Go see Worth it. Worth every penny, rupee to go, go, go yeah, see this. Go. Mm -hmm. So I won't give that spoiler away, but she is beautiful. And yeah. when she dances for the British, they get what just desserts. I'm just going to yeah. say that. Right? Mm -hmm. So. That's so the ending, and I I know you guys know the ending is sad, yeah. but my favorite part about the ending is his speech to the people uh, before he he gets hanged, and um, I cried. I cried. Oh my god, the I ending! Cried. I even like any other scenes. I was like, yeah, there were a few I other teary eyed bad. scenes. Um, this my, one. I think I I didn't know if I was one gonna the, make it out of the movie theater without the tissue. One of the, the worst tissue. things was when the mother put her um put her like her dress below it, and she's like, "Every drop is another um, Syrah being reborn." Right. And I was like, "Oh my god." Yeah. Mine. I mean, he tells everybody to lift their heads because they're all yeah. They're, they're all like lifting their heads. Sad down. to see him go and um. You know, he comes with this big wooden piece attached mm -hmm. to him where he's with, going like, chains. chains on him. It, it reminds me a little bit of Jesus on the cross when when they crucified him. Like, yeah. such a uh, he's such an inspiring person, such a great person. And, you know, uh, the British obviously just wanted to take over India and they had yeah. their own things. But, you know, the people that crucified Christ... It, it's just one of those things like people thought he was bad, some, you know, and and that's what it reminded me of. But then when he goes up there and he tells everybody to lift their head, this is just the beginning of the struggle and the fight, and we are going to win for the freedom. And this yeah. is our, our land and our, our country, and we should, you know, be proud, and, and this is not the end. And, like, have a celebration to remind of all the fun. Yeah. And yeah, and then she of catches the, the blood, yeah. and like it's like you know this was every drop is another Namshar ready to be born again and to fight the fight, and yeah. then you know win in the end. And, um, just just an amazing movie. Yeah. The mm -hmm. the quotes in it very poetic and very um, like Amitra Bachchan plays in it more than we thought. Like. We kind of thought he was only going to be in one or two clips. He yeah. he actually has small parts, but significant Big, parts. parts. Yeah, like his mm -hmm. speeches he gives to Chiranjeevi to Syrah are very um, solid. Not solid, but like um, powerful words, and um, you know to kind of help him with the fight and the struggle. And yeah. he's kind of his like reminds like a. A uh, priestly, a priest, or you know, uh, that kind of is his per spiritual person who he goes yeah. to, kind of for help or, or inspiration, and that's what he seemed to be. And he was in an, enough of it that he really played like a significant role, even though his time on screen wasn't huge in each part. Yeah. Um, but amazing, and him with the long. I mean, he just played that part yeah. to a T, and. Uh, yeah, I really liked that one. 
All right. Who is your favorite actor in this? My movie? favorite actor was Sarah. Right. Uh, Sharon GV. Yeah. Sharon GV. Yes. The boss. He definitely. It seemed to take him a little while to really fulfill the character. I feel like when the struggle fight started was really when his character really blossomed. Yeah. Um, some of my favorite scenes are just his eyes. Like the shot. Oh, like the shot eyes. of his just eyes. Yeah. yeah. Just intense. Like he definitely brought that intense nature. And I definitely think he, you know, kind of used to him a little bit more of songs and dance and fun. And um, this was definitely a serious movie, but he played it well, I think. I mean, yeah. and, like mm-hmm. he really brought it through and um, it awesome. Yeah. In those mm-hmm. fight scenes. Oh, the two yeah. swords. Yeah. He mm-hmm. does a lot of really cool fighting in this one. Um, who was your favorite character, Angie? My favorite character is probably Lakshmi. Mm. Um, only because of her singing and her dancing that inspired and made people want to join with um, Sharon GB or Syra. Right. And yeah. it was really... Her dancing was beautiful. And yeah. the song, yeah, I loved it. Um, Especially when... Um, the other character, the other girl, his wife, Sharon, yeah. Syra's wife, came in and sang with her. Mm-hmm. And then they kind of realize how each other is connected. And how they're, like, yeah. together. Yeah. Yeah. It was really cool. And uh, But Lakshmi, I mean, she is beautiful, yeah. beautiful. And, uh, yeah, plays that role really well. Um, trying to think who else was in it. I'm sure watching Sharon GV, we love him. And, uh, oh, Subaya. Mm-hmm. So the old man is probably another big character. Yes. Um, because Charon GV, I think, takes him to heart. Like Another thing is, like, you don't expect a big character like him in the beginning. Mm-hmm. But once you realize how big his part is, what, when you're going on to the movie, you see how big his part is. Yeah, so mm-hmm. he kind of comes in a few of the key spots, the fights yeah. and the struggle and, um, but he's like this little old man. Almost, I want to say Charanji treats him like a, a father figure. Yeah. And, um, you know, in the end, when he loses to the struggle, you know, Charanji names his son after him. Because he's like, somebody will reborn when somebody else dies and his son was born at the, the same, same time. time. Yeah. And so he names him Subaya. But this little old man, you know, he's like a farmer. And, um, you know, he is like, I am part of the struggle. I will, yeah, like he didn't want to give his land over to the British. So he, so ran. he ran with the horse, even though he knew he was going to lose, he was like, I will give my all and give my best. Mm-hmm. And this is for my people. And, and so even though his struggle is small, you know, and, but he joins the big struggle, He's like every other little farmer, you know, yeah. that maybe needs a hand or, you know, needs some help. And it's just, you know, it was a really nice way to tie it in with everything. So this yeah. movie was definitely amazing, yeah. amazing. Yes. And um, our favorite one of, I mean, compared to Bahubali, and we love Bahubali, and there was lots of little pieces of Bahubali in this. Mm-hmm. I think part of it was... It was an older historical movie like Bahubali. Yeah. So you felt that too. And then with the temples and the flowers and the colors and the costumes, yeah. they were just beautiful. And so it had a lot of that Bahubali feel to it. But the struggle and the story behind it all, I think, was better. Yeah. Um, because yeah. Bahubali is a little bit more like, godly and more of like a fictional story like kind of fantasy fantasy yeah Yeah. and this was based on true events in indian history and just the storyline was so well done out i think like you know it was three hours long but we didn't know it was three hours long yeah and it was just amazing, amazing. Comparing it to like Bahubali, because okay. it kind of has a similar feel. And Saho, we know, we just went and saw in the movie theater. Yes. Um, you know, where would you rate, do you think it's going to be a blockbuster hit? Like, I hope so. It, it's amazing. And if you haven't seen it, yeah. go see it. But Yeah. 
I hope it is, but I just wonder, will it be? Has it done enough advertising? Has it has it done enough in the movie to to be go ahead? To be good. Okay. So my thinking is it will be higher than Saho, but I don't know if it'll reach that like Bahubali kind of feel because I feel like it needed more songs into mm. it because it only had like two songs inside yeah. of it and that was only when Lakshmi was dancing. So I think it needed more songs like influenced with the war and influence with other stuff. Yeah. Yeah, that was probably the one big place. Yeah. You know, it was an awesome movie. And yeah. I don't know where they would have put these other songs, but it definitely, you know, Bahubali had so many songs. I like six or seven. And really it just, I think, helped make the movie. And so yeah. somehow. And then yeah. they would have had more things to like bring out to the public, and the public would have been, oh my right. god, I need the song. I need to watch the movie. Right. Because that's yeah. what happened with Bahu Bali. They put the out advertisements some songs. Or the way they meet, like projected it out there yeah. wasn't maybe enough, I feel like. Um, you know, needed a few more teasers or trailers. And, and if there was more than one song or two songs, they could have done a few more song teasers yeah, and song teasers and songs. And actual and, songs. Um, so with Saho, I think they marketed it really they well. They marketed it really good. Yeah. But the actual movie itself, the storyline, the storyline was the, a little lacking. It it was lacking because it went like it went straight, like it was like a good storyline, but I think they got off track. Yeah, it was definitely a little bit more Hollywood. Um, than Bollywood, I think, yeah. Saho. But they marketed it so well. That and people Prabhas, went and saw yeah, it. Yeah, is amazing. I mean, it was good. It, it was a just, good movie. The storyline kind of got us confused. Even yeah. in the end, I wasn't really sure I was like, what was happening. Kind of but uh, it was a good movie. Bahu Bali, we love Bahu Bali. Oh, and, yeah. And, and the music. and But for this... I hope it does as well, if not better, because it has historical yeah. background to it, because it's about the British, the fighting the British, yeah. and, you know, how horrible it was, and how people had to really come together, and, and you know, we're all about peace here, and In Gandhi. Gandhi, and peace is the answer, and, and we love, you know, I don't, I'm not completely thinking that violence isn't always the answer because it usually isn't. It usually just brings more violence. Yes. And that's kind of what happened here in the story. But I think it built up some of that we need to fight together. Yes. Mm -hmm. And maybe that's, you know, that then helped when, can join some. Yeah. And I know at the end, if you notice, as the credits go by, they show different people in yeah. history, in Indian history. Like and Abdul Kalam and Gandhi. There was a lot. There a was lot a lot of people. And some people um, I remember from when we did the national anthem, mm -hmm. and we were doing national anthem, some yeah. people I remember that they were showing. Yeah. And so different people in history that helped with the struggle and helped yeah. with the mm -hmm. fight and had good messages and, you know, just... I think Gandhi got more people to fight with him because it was nonviolent way, yeah. you know, that people weren't going to get killed. They just, you know, stopped buying the salts and stopped buying the, you know, clothing and doing more like mm -hmm. sit in and protest quietly Yeah, that he got more people on board. And, and then I think the British just felt like, you know, I think the British built up more anger like you could see it in this movie because of the fight yeah you know like they were like well they're not going to kill our soldiers and they're not going to take our money mm -hmm. and we're going to take their stuff and and you you don't see that you know i think the british give up when there is no fight people don't want to fight somebody that's not fighting them the other, back the other thing that i didn't like about when the british in the soldiers where they were like you're stealing you're a burglar basically you're um a criminal and it's like well technically you are right. the criminal we're stealing back what's ours right we're not stealing we're taking back what's ours you're stealing from us right you're taking everything i mean everything yeah some of these scenes like 
you know, oh, you don't have the money, so we're going to take every grain of rice you have collected over the year Mm -hmm. and, you know, and we're going to leave you with nothing. Yeah. Um, Just, it really showed a lot of um, emotion. Emotion. That, this, so I feel like, minus having a couple of few, needed a few more songs, Mm -hmm. it really had a beautiful Indian movie feel to it. You know, it was emotional it, it was, was some his, love story and there it. was love story in it there was you know the freedom fight in it i mean it just had a little bit of everything and maybe two more songs would have just put it over the top oh, i yeah. think um though like i said i don't know where he would have put the songs but i feel like they there had to be a few other places that maybe he could have sang like about the struggle himself like to get people ready for war or mm-hmm. something you know they're needed i think that would have kind of put it a little bit more in the bahubali category but yeah. this movie the cinematography the, the pictures in this the fight scenes in this the costumes oh my god yeah and if the you makeup, haven't up and I mean, if you haven't seen it already you should totally go to the movie theater and see it yes go yeah. see this this yeah. is worth Every penny, every second, every minute, yeah, that you sit there, like this movie was amazing. Yeah, amazing. Bring tissues with you because, oh, yeah. as much as I, I was like, didn't think so, there were a few scenes where the little boy talks oh, about yeah. stealing the food, that and was, his like, mom so was sad. like, like so offended that she stole, but he was like, my mom hasn't eaten. Okay, so then I'm crying, and then. In the end, when he before he gets hung, you know, he tells everybody lift their heads. This is yeah. about the struggle and this is about your freedom and this is just the beginning and he's revving them all up and I am bawling my eyes. Out. I'm so bawling, but I'm like yeah. daddy's looking at me and I'm like, no. Yeah. <laughs> trying to wipe my tears. I was just hoping my makeup wasn't quite a mess and that I would leave the movie theater and not look too terrible because when I cry I get all blotchy. But this movie, I would see it again and again. I would see it so many times. I would see it as many times as I've seen Bohu Bali. And I've seen Bohu Bali so many times. We watch it, like, a lot. What is your favorite part in this movie? My favorite part is, like, when the um, British guy cut his head off, but he was still moving. Oh, yeah. And then he kills both of them. Mm -hmm. Mm Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, Something that probably wouldn't really happen in real life, but... (laughs) Uh, made it very epic in the ending so this movie is worth it yes. go see it if you haven't go see it. go see it yes Beautiful, literally just go see it amazing and the only thing we would add is songs yeah a couple more songs i think yeah at least two more songs would have kind of made it um a little bit more and then I think my husband was talking a little bit about maybe some actors from the North more so that it had a little bit more variety in it and would have gotten the crowd from there as well, not just the Southern crowd, um, to make it a little bit more globally, but advertising more. And maybe with some more songs, they could have done some more They could have advertised, like, you know how Saha did, like, trailers for the songs, and I was like... Yeah, yeah, like a like forty-five second teaser 45 to second the song. Teaser to a song, and, and then I'm the like, song came out like two days later, and it was two minutes long, and it was yeah. like, <sighs> yeah. But they did two songs or th- three songs, three at songs, least. yeah. And then two or three teasers, and then I feel like every time you turned on something, there was something, something about Saho new. and Prabhas. So the hype of it really was huge, and yeah. I feel like this wasn't as big, and it should be. Like, it, it really should. should be, because it has such historical background to it that really just, you know, makes you want to join the fight and and so proud that the freedom that's here, yeah. you know. From it, so it definitely was part of the struggle, and I loved it. So I hope you guys like this. And if you like this video, don't forget to click that like button down below. Because the more you like, the more YouTube shares our videos. And don't forget to subscribe. Yep, and join our wonderful family, and we'll see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. Bye.